So this is the fun part, guys. We're gonna dangle now, and this, let's see what happens. This oh, is boy. why we have a floorless oh, roller coaster. <laughs> so you just Here hang we go. Out. We're just hanging out. <laughs> Jared Aarons, you're a crazy man. And that is our 10 News reporter, Jared Aaron, to get a sneak peek at SeaWorld's newest roller coaster, the Emperor. He tells us it's unlike anything at the park and it signals a new era for SeaWorld. The park is putting less emphasis on animals and shows and more on rides and thrills. Oh, this is amazing. The great yeah. ride. <laughs> Woo! It's 153 feet tall and goes 60 miles an hour. Emperor, the tallest, fastest, longest dive coaster in California, will take your breath away, just like it did to me. Right now, one more time. Oh, oh, oh. And to the other American coaster enthusiasts lucky enough to ride Monday morning. As soon as it releases from the lift, I'm just giggling the whole time. And wee. This type of roller coaster, like right here, this is kind of stuff I live for. It will also take SeaWorld in a new direction. Emperor is the third roller coaster to open since 2018, a new focus on rides over animals as a way to reverse years of declining attendance in the wake of the backlash over the Blackfish documentary. It creates a diversity in our park where we have the animals and we have the people that love the animals and now we're opening it up and inviting more members of the family that are going to enjoy the thrill part of the rides as well. Emperor strikes a balance between the two sides. It's named after the Emperor Penguin. <laughs> SeaWorld is the only place in North America that has them. The rides dive, loops, and turns mimic the movement of the penguins in water. That connection to the animals is really important to us, and we all um, take that heart as employees. Along with heart-stopping thrills, a more complete park ready to dive into a new era. Yeah. Here we go. Oh man, that was awesome. <laughs> uh, what do you think? How was it? <laughs> Emperor opens to the general public on March 12th. If you're an annual pass holder, there are some preview days over the next couple weeks. And there's more to come. SeaWorld's going to open Sesame Place in Chula Vista at the end of March. I'm told there are also plans to redo the Arctic Expedition with a brand new ride over the next couple years. At SeaWorld, Jared Aarons, ABC 10 News. More rides for Jared coming.